Hello, my name is Darren Burgos, and thank you for watching my main stage tutorial for performing keyboardists. I've been making and performing electronic music with computers for over 25 years, so main stage is a natural fit for me. I've played at parties, clubs, and events across the United States and Mexico. Even if you're not computer savvy, main stage is a very easy to use, powerful application that will get you up and performing in no time. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how a keyboardist can use MainStage while performing live. We'll be looking at MainStage from a keyboardist's point of view, while playing along with a live band or other musicians, as well as looking at MainStage through the eyes of a solo artist, playing along in sync with backing tracks, adding loops, beats, effects, and singing through MainStage effects. So you might ask yourself, why use MainStage over a digital audio workstation? MainStage was created specifically for performing live. It doesn't have all the unnecessary stuff like a MIDI sequencer, a multi-track audio recorder, and score editing like Logic and others. MainStage focuses on just the tools you need for a great performance. Not only can you switch between patches seamlessly like we looked at in the intro tutorial, but you can easily hardwire MIDI controllers to specific instruments, create keyboard splits, and unlike Logic, you can save massive sounding patches with stacked virtual instruments. In the main stage intro tutorial, we looked at an overview of the application. We talked about the three main levels of the patch list, understanding the importance of channel strips, using MIDI controllers, and we even briefly looked at mapping and assigning screen controls. We'll focus on all these and much more in greater detail, all with the performing keyboardist in mind. Now let's go get started.